what are you doing? So, a quick little story for you guys. Uh, the other day, man, uh, I was riding on this road, right? And uh, I had just gotten back from, uh, I had just pressure washed my bike, right? I didn't think anything of it. I got freaking water, like uh, in the spark plug hole, all right? I got it in between the spark plug and the spark plug boot. Yeah. What is going on with this bike? I don't really know. Um, but anyways, water got in there and it messed up the connection. All right, so <laughs> I was on my way down this road and all of a sudden my bike would just go blah, 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 and it would stop. So just be running the engine, uh, turning the engine over just from the wheel. No spark. So uh, I had to reach underneath the gas tank, wiggle it around while I'm still on the, my head, hanging on the bike while it's going like 40 miles an hour, right? My head's in between my legs practically, my hand's underneath the gas tank. And if you have a DRZ, you know how hard that freaking is. Not easy. And uh, I was down there wiggling the thing around, trying to get uh, uh, get the thing to connect spark well i got a spark started up kept going and then i died again at about 100 feet i had to pull over fix it i did that like six times on my way home so uh needless to say uh, whenever you uh want to wash your bike don't wash underneath a spark plug boot bad news you're not gonna make it home if you do <laughs> um so yeah, a little, little pro tip. If you're really gonna wash your bike, buy all the stuff that uh, they recommend. Um, like the little, I think they have like a spark plug cover that waterproofs it pretty well. And then they got like an airbox cover. And then uh, of course the butt plug for your, your exhaust. Um, yeah, buy all that stuff. You're gonna really pressure wash the bike. Save you, save you a lot of frustration. But anyways, the way I fixed this uh, this issue, I went by Advanced Auto Parts, got some dielectric grease, and I got some, uh, what's it called? Um, the uh, contact cleaner. Clean electrical contacts, all right? Not, not eye contacts. That would just be terrible for everyone if you sprayed that stuff on your contacts, put it in your, anyways. Contact cleaner, I bought some of that stuff. Cleaned out all the uh, connections, right? Got all the water and stuff out. And uh, yeah, if you notice, I have a bad, bad relationship with the water and my motorcycle. They don't mix at all. Anyways, um, yeah, clean that crap off. And I, I filled that whole freaking uh, spark plug boot with dielectric grease. And lo and behold, connected problem was gone my bike ran perfectly ripping wheelies good to go I was happy end of story so moral of the story uh, moral of the story um, freaking give me some warning before you turn left but uh moral of the story Uh, moral of the story, I don't know what he's doing back here. I'm cold. Um, moral of the story, dial it to grease on everything. It will save you. Make all the contacts nice and good. Oh, that was cool. Um, but yeah. Don't, don't put your bike underwater like I did. <laughs> it will ruin everything. And then when you go to wash it, do it right. Don't be stupid. So, in the end, don't be a journeyman. Be smarter about it. Right now, I don't know what we're doing in a Walmart parking lot. We're doing something mischievous. I have no idea what's going on. Yay! 
Atta boy. Baggage.